So, the development of a new knife made according to the scheme with the locomotive mechanism is completed. I want to tell you how the improvements were carried out, what difficulties we encountered and what we actually managed to achieve. Briefly about the developers. The developers of the project are Nikolai Trushin. This is an invention, design, engineering, 3D, CNC modeling of all parts of the mechanism, all parts of the knife, with the exception of the severed elements and the blade. Ashid Yurievich Hakobian is the manufacturer of sevi elements, pins, bushings and final grinding, respectively, of parts. Mikhail Rabradov, CNC Blades and Alexei Stratov, Formation of Blade Descents. The company's dyes and plans were given for anodizing. So, well, it's been more than a year since the last knife. Actually, why did it take so long? Because they tried to reach a certain system level of production, when all operations were repeatable and manual labor was tried to be reduced to. Well, not exactly at no, but to minimize. Accordingly, it did not work out the first time, and now I will show, for example, how many improvements there would be with the most complex details. This is a mountain of bearings, not all of which, respectively, are unique bearings in this knife, which went into marriage. Then they studied. I learned to engrave. There are some samples and, accordingly, also defective parts due to the fact that there were manufacturing errors on the CNC. There are also some experiments on the engraving of the die. Problems with accuracy and with shifts when turning on the CNC, went into marriage, and so on, and so on. But the main problem, of course, was with the bearings. But, nevertheless, we have achieved a result. We got a new knife and I must say that it turned out just great. To be honest, I have not seen such a perfect techno device, which is made qualitatively, thanks to how it is the property of the Yurievich root, that is, to be honest, I have not seen it in my life. That is, working with him, well, just holding him in your hands is some kind of separate pleasure. Everything is like actually tick to tick. At the final stage, we brought all the axial elements, thanks to which the mechanism actually performs its functions. Well, that's how it turned out so great. So, what has changed in this version of the knife compared to the previous one? So, the design and functionality of these side frames have changed a little. This means that there are such holes through which it will be possible to clean the grooves in the mechanism that were previously deaf. Now they can be cleaned with simple matches there is something else and something if clogged. Next. The engraving is applied, that is, on the one hand it is quite interesting and at one time I really wanted to repeat in some way the design of the clock mechanisms, when all sorts of interesting numbers and letters are applied on the back cover, but at the same time it performs some functionality. Here an arrow is engraved on the connecting rod, which on the divisions into frames shows the degree of approach of the slider in the fixation area. Accordingly, as soon as we went beyond zero, the knife is already fixed. Here is the ideal position, it is there one, one and a half and further levels of entry will be selected when the mechanism wears out. But in fact, the mechanism of excessive wear of the racks in this sense. The previous instance has already been working for a year on continuous, as it were, repetitive opening and closing, because it seemed to be a very meditative procedure and, in general, no change in the depth of entry was detected. Well, because the video has also been made. 
a slider in the form of a roller. So, probably, it will not be visible. Here its wear will be minimal, because it will rotate gradually and, as it were, the thing will be erased in diameter. So, next, what else? The axial bushing has been changed. If on the first knife it was a bushing with a locking thread, also patented, with two screws, then now it is brought in accordance with the design described in the patent. This is a blind sleeve, respectively, a different output with a nut and a release screw. So, here it turns out that our hat is fixed in slots, which are fixed in the frame with slots. That is, exactly such slots for a curly hat are selected here. So, next. So, technically, the rest remains almost the same, but the internal configuration has been changed a little, but it's already technically a long time to tell the details there. What happened? Well, it turned out to be a knife, which, to be honest, I'm a little bit afraid to use there, well, in quotes, of course, it's scary, because the high quality manufactured and polished, polished side parts, connecting rods, blade led to the fact that some kind of techno jewelry turned out. And carefully thought out all the details of the mechanism have already led to the fact that using it as such a meditative device has somehow become a little unusual. That is, if the first one just flew out like a cannon, then this one works like, I do not know if someone bought a new car of such very high quality once, I looked through all the details there such funny sounds of some trunk doors closing there, I do not know, something here is in full growth. What I want to say about manufacturing. Well, it's clear now. That is, with this pressure, we prove that the production can be serial, that is, it is not a one-time manual work and now, probably, we will somehow go to the production of a series. Actually, probably, according to the modifications and forecasts everything. Well, yes, that's it. Thank you. I hope that fans of mechanisms will live to the moment when they can afford to buy this knife. And I think they'll all be thrilled. At least, I would have squeaked in my time with delight when I saw such a device. That is, it really turned out something like this. Something really turned out to be something unreal. Thank you.